Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Maureen Luck. So in today's video, I want to prepare dinner with you. So I'll be cooking ugali with beef and cabbage. Stay tuned. Meantime, leave a like, leave a comment. In case you are new here, remember to subscribe. Then watch till the end. My tomato. Then my onions. Yeah, I'll be preparing two meals. That's why I have separated like the onions, beef and cabbage, beef and cabbage. Then this one, I'll have to divide them. Here I have my cabbage, which is raw. I have just washed it. I want it to drain the water first. I have meat. It is just a quarter for one person. Yeah, I have boiled it already, so I want to fry it. I have added the coriander. I think it is ready. Put some oil. That is it. Then Okay, so guys, I have already prepared the beef. It is a wet fry beef. Then, right now, I want to prepare the cabbage. Later on, we will finish with the garlic. Stay tuned.
as I said, I'll be preparing a wet frame package. And uh, so I want to be adding water. No water at all. My cabbage is ready, so let's head to Ugali. Here is the water. I want to prepare the Ugali. I have finished preparing the cabbage, so I'm heading to Ugali. Let the water boil first, then after boiling, it is when we will be preparing Ugali and we call it dinner. The water has boiled. Let's prepare ugali. And, um, let me add a pinch of flour. I don't know the reason that I need to Okay, just add. Just like that. I'm preparing ugali for one person. Just for myself. So. That is it. is going to be ready in a few minutes.
finished preparing my meal and here it is here is my ugali it is flour that comes from corns or maize so here in kenya we take ugali which happens to be our staple food for most people in kenya then here is my cabbage here is my cabbage and the beef and here is my beef guys and the water for refreshment yeah That is it about how I prepare dinner and hope you've enjoyed the video leave a like leave a comment in case you're new here remember to subscribe then hit the notification bell bye bye see you next time